It's a three-store kind of grocery haul before we get to Costco and Trader Joe's. Work it, make it, do it, makes us harder, better, faster, stronger. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole. If you are new, thanks so much for stopping by. I have a grocery haul for y'all today. We went to Sam's Club, Target, and Walmart. We did the pickup at Sam's and Target. We always go in at Walmart. You know, drama. We are so stoked to go, uh, at least I should say, I am so stoked to go to Trader Joe's. I have a list a mile long, but like I mentioned at the end of this video, please comment down below what items I need to be on the lookout for Trader Joe's. Anybody that's following the same type of lifestyle that I'm following, anything that your kids absolutely love from Trader Joe's since back to school is starting, please comment that down below so I can add it to my list because when you're watching this, we are on our way, y'all. We'll see that Trader Joe's haul this Saturday. So make sure your notification bell is clicked. You're subscribed, all the things, because you will see it in a few days. And Costco will be coming the following week. Let's get into this week's haul, though, and show you what we got from all three stores. Three stores for our weekly grocery haul until we get to Costco and Trader Joe's. I think we're a little too excited for Trader Joe's. Y'all stay tuned. It'll be two separate videos and I have a huge Thrive order back there as well, plus another box sitting outside. I need to go get because it's freaking hot. But let's jump into it. We're going to do Sam's Club first. We spent 97 bucks at Sam's Club. Only got things that I know that we use on a regular because, like I said, we're excited to go in store in Costco and things that we needed now before we get to Costco. Needed some cucumbers. I love the English ones over at Sam's Club. Such a great deal. And I go through probably almost a single one a day. I know, craziness. But if you're doing the anabolic high volume diet, you can eat legit one of these for like no calories and it fills you up and it's good for you. Got the boys some more of the grapes. It's such a killer price right now at Sam's, y'all. Don't buy them at your local grocery store unless they have like a specific deal. So good for three pounds and it lasts them over a week. They love grapes. I always preach if I can get any type of whole foods, fruits and veggies in my kids, I try to pump that in them more than anything else. I needed some baby bella mushrooms. This is something that I always get over at Sam's because you get 24 ounces and again, these last a long time as well. So we're out of the Vital Farms eggs. Y'all saw me haul those last week, I think. And I just got these to Titus until we get to Costco. From what I remember, it's been almost two years since I've been to my Costco. And they're all so different, right? They had the really good eggs at Costco for a great price. And we're not going through a ton of whole eggs. As you can see, we're going through more egg whites. But we do eat whole eggs for our good, healthy heart fat. So I got the cage-free brown eggs since they didn't have the other ones. I needed some more of the liquid egg whites. I always get these probably like once a week, once every two weeks. I eat a ton of egg whites, as most of you guys know. If you watch my weekly vlogs or my what I eat in a days, you will see exactly what this girl eats. Six cartons, 16 ounces for under nine bucks. Can't go wrong. Got a huge bag of shredded iceberg lettuce. We're gonna be making taco nachos with the Quest chips. So what I'm gonna do is just pile a bunch of that iceberg with the nacho chips and with some meat, some fat-free cheese and all the good toppings. And it's gonna be high volume, fill you up, but be perfect for Taco Tuesday. Got another bag of the sweet potatoes. I always get these over there. You get, I think it's five pounds or three pounds, but we're always eating baked sweet potatoes on the side, like with nothing added to it, guys. You just had to add a little bit of Lakanto monk fruit and some cinnamon and it's fire like that. Or y'all know I like to do my fries in the air fryer. Got the boys some more of the homemaker premium orange juice. Such a group, good price for two of them. Them, and this is this is really good when I was drinking orange juice way back before keto I remember this tasting better than the other ones in my opinion So if you're an orange juice drinker or your kids are pick this one up Give it a try. Let me know what you think got the members mark broccoli for us Y'all saw me just haul these Trey. if y'all have been following me for any amount of time Trey is not my picky eater anymore Waylon is the tides have turned Trey is eating all the things all the good things and I'm so here for it because y'all know It was so hard with him with his autism and his sensory and now he is trying things and not only trying, but loving them. He's eating like a bag of broccoli a day. I'm not even joking. And I, oh my gosh, I'm so here for it. I got another one of those because he's eating it and I'm eating it like crazy. Also for the boys, I got them the big box. I reached out to you guys on Instagram and I realized that Sam's does sell these. So this is the baked Frito-Lay mix. You get eight of the baked Cheetos. You get eight of the baked regular. They're really not a fan of these. I wish they always do that, right? And six of the barbecue. Waylon loves that one. Waylon loves the cheddar and sour cream. And he loves the uh, sour cream and onion. Waylon loves all the things he's not supposed to love. Little turd right there. But I got that to go in their lunch boxes. Better option than the regular. So I'm here for it. 
Old Spice deodorant. I always pick this up when they do the instant savings and the instant savings was going on. You get five of these for such a great price. This is my husband's favorite deodorant. Y'all let me know in the comments below. Are your husbands picky? Do they have to have the white? Like the white deodorant, you know what I'm talking about? Or do they have to have like the clear stick or the gel stick? He has to have the gel stick. I mean, where do the boys get their sensory from? Let's just be real. Not only is the hubby wearing deodorant right now, but Trey is too. I mean, he is going to be nine and we're already having like the teenager smells. It's crazy. Speaking of teenager smells, I got a huge bag of 22 bars of the Dial soap. I just ran out of soap from my couponing days, guys. It's been three years since I couponed. Can y'all believe that? Three years and we just ran out of bar soap. So you can live off your stockpile for a long time, just saying. But we were out of bar soap, and again, the hubby does not like body wash. He likes bar soap, and he said just get the cheapest one. I was going to get the Irish Spring because that's what they've been using, and it's pretty cheap over at Sam's, but they were out of stock. So I got the Dial Spring Water. I was out of all the things. Like, how does this happen? Does this happen to you guys? You, like, run out of one thing, and then everything else, like, follows through. I swear. Y'all know I swear by this glad press and seal. No, not sponsored. Glad, where are you at, girl? Because we need to get together. I've been preaching about this since, buff, like, way back in couponing days. Like, for sure. Press and seal. Love it. I am out. So I had to get that. It is such a killer deal over at Sam's. Speaking of good deals, parchment paper over there, the two pack. They also have the sheets, but it's not as good of a deal. But for convenience, yeah, but I just cut it and it's good to go. And I am legit out. I don't even have any right now. I've been using just aluminum foil. Struggles are real. So that is everything I got at Sam's until we can get to the Costco and to the Trader Joe's for 97 bucks. For Target right here, $27. Can you believe that? With tax, 27 bucks. That's it. And y'all are saying that the cartwheel doesn't have as good deals on y'all's just check it every day it changes and for me too so i'm always checking that thing because it's got some crazy things going on got some romaine hearts this is cheaper over at target than it is at walmart so i was like uh no brainer there i love this good and gather all natural turkey sausage it's way better macros than the butterball one and it's hella cheap over at target and they're always out of stock we are making that hash brown bake again it is a tried and true guys and it is delicious i will link that recipe down in the description box for y'all because you need to have it in your life asap got some raspberries very happy with the produce that target gave me today i'm kind of leery about that with target sometimes but they've been doing a great job and these raspberries look bomb i'm gonna be putting those on a salad tried the canada dry last week y'all and i am legit obsessed like this is the goat of zero sugar sodas i am just saying if you like ginger ale you are going to be obsessed with this this tastes just like regular ginger ale in my opinion i cannot tell the difference they did not have the two liter they did not have any of the ones they just had these little bottles but this is great at night for me to drink like half a one or even a whole one and not have the caffeine their yogurts were buy one get one 25 percent off if you did the pickup that was awesome and also they had a digital 75 cent for the light and fit only if you go in store though so there are some little snags there but i got the oikos blueberry because they don't sell that in the big pack at sam's club the boys love it i wanted to get the cherry they were out of stock so what i did is i want to try some of these light and fit ones of the flavors that don't come in like too good i love the two good yogurts and they are better ingredients but these are flavors that the other ones don't have so i got a four pack of the banana cream they are 80 calories and 12 proteins so the same macros as far as the two good but i think they're like eight or nine net carbs they're a little bit higher in carb than two good if you are interested Strawberry wasted for days. They were buy one, get one 50% off with doing the pickup. And the cartwheel had an additional 20% offer you could stack on top of that. And these were only $2.37 originally priced. Such an awesome deal. So I got four of them. And let me add, they look beautiful. Love the Driscoll strawberries, berries all the way around. And then we got the sliced strawberries from Good and Gather because Walmart didn't have them. And again, another great deal. I like to let these thaw out and put them on top of my protein waffles. I've been making really good. And just add some Lakanto sweetener. You're set. 27 bucks, guys. Can you believe it? And then last but not least, we, went, we ran into Walmart. I don't do the pickup at Walmart, as you guys know. We found some fun things, some non-food items I want to share with you guys, and a couple of food items that I'm super excited about. So first thing, I got the Pick Sweet Farms 3 Pepper and Onion Blend. What I plan on doing with this is adding it to my egg whites instead of getting that Southwestern one. You know what I'm talking about? If you've been watching the vlogs that already has the onions and stuff in it, I mean, questionable, right? Let's just stick with whole egg whites and add our whole stuff and be good with it. And these are already chopped and ready to go. Such a great way to make like an omelet in the morning or scrambled eggs with some extra veg in it. I'm here for it. I love that. And it's a good price. 
the light and fit Greek yogurts I was just talking about. I wanted to try some flavors before I committed to a huge thing. They have the limited time flavors over at Walmart. So they have the Greek tiramisu. So I was going to give that one a try. It looks bomb. And they also have the limited caramel apple pie. Yes, please. And then strawberry cheesecake they were sold out of at Target. I was going to get a big, big pack of that because I remember liking that when I lost my initial 85 pounds. I ate these all the time. They were a lifesaver. I am happy to have those back in my journey. And hopefully these new flavors are going to be good. I'll update you guys in the vlogs and the what I eat in a day. So make sure you subscribe, bell click so you don't miss those videos. Something brand new, guys. Alert, alert. Pay attention right now. Y'all know that Joseph's lavish bread, like the big long things, you can make pizzas and stuff on those. They're 120 calories for the big huge ones, or you can cut them in half and they're 60. These pita breads, I mean, look how big they are. They are very substantial size. And I was shocked by the macros. So just one of them is 60 calories, one and a half fat, 10 total carbs, four fiber. So six net carbs and six protein. Let's go. What I plan on doing with these is they were out of my beloved keto buns that are 50 calories each. I'm hoping Costco has them, but I plan on using these and folding them over for like patty melts or burgers and using this as my bun versus the keto ones, if that makes sense, because they're the same macros, basically a little bit higher, but not much and hella big. You can make pizzas on these. You could uh, put these for a breakfast burrito in the morning. These were less than $3 too. The keto buns are like $5 a pack. We've talked about that. So that was a win. I can't wait to try that. Other food item, but before we get into the non-food items was the Premier Protein. I want to try their cookies and cream flavor. I know Costco right now has like $7 off is their new offer for the Premier Protein. And if I like it, I'll get a big case, but I didn't want to get like 30 of them and hate it. My favorite so far is a cinnamon swirl. I didn't like the coffee latte one. It wasn't my favorite, but I did like the cinnamon one and I want to give this one a go. I love the Alani new and the Quest shakes are actually better than these. But these are good too. Non-food items. We needed paper plates. Yes, we use paper plates in this house and Walmart has the best deal better than Sam's Club, even with the instant savings on some paper plates they had going on. And we like this size. This size is hard to find in the big club store or they're just not a good deal. The eight and three eighths inch is what we like. 300 plates, I think it was like $7 and some change. That is killer and that will last us a long time. I got this colander. I just thought it was bomb with the handle like this. I know Kim from the Wads, if y'all like her channel, she has one like this and she raves about it all the time. It was $2. Like they have all their college stuff out for Walmart just like Target does. And I was not leaving without that because that looked awesome and it reminded me of Kim. I got these glass bowls. They were only 94 cents. If you follow me on Instagram or follow the vlogs, you know I've been drinking my iced coffee out of those glass uh, cups. They were also just 94 cents. I got them at Walmart. So these are huge, guys. These are... I don't, and it tells you 5.75 inches, but as far as ounces, I'm not sure, but I know they're the same size pretty much as the ones I got from Target and they are plastic. So you're paying the same price for glass. I mean, you cannot go wrong with that. I got a set of four because I was only going to get a couple. I said, girl, get the set of four. They're 94 cents. I got some mugs. Did I need these? No. Did I want them? Yes. Hands up in the air in the comment section down below. If you are like that with certain ish, when you go to the store, like, it is a problem, but I saw everybody on Instagram hauling these and they were legit like under $3. I am not responsible for what my face does when you talk. Um, yes, please. That is me in the first thing in the morning and I don't give a sip. Like that was just me to a T. I was like, oh, those are coming home with me right now. Even though we don't need a freaking mug to save our life, had to have them. So everything from Walmart guys was about 40 bucks that you see here. So 40 bucks, $27 from Target and $97 for Sam's Club until we can get up into the Trader Joe's, y'all, Trader Joe's. I've got a list a mile long. I've been watching all the videos, following all the Instagram accounts. Y'all let me know down below what the girl needs from Trader Joe's and Costco. Last chance because we are going like now. So that's going to do it for this week's grocery haul. Thank y'all so much for watching. If you enjoy these grocery hauls every single week and if you are so stoked like I am to see that Trader Joe's and Costco haul, make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up. And again, don't forget to hit all the bells and whistles so you don't miss all the fun grocery hauls I have coming. I cannot wait to go and I cannot wait to share them with you guys. Until the next one, we will see you then. We're so excited. Comment down below. Bye, y'all.